this is the fulcrum push-up. So with a normal push-up, obviously there's lower and lift. This one has just one extra component. Well, maybe two, because what you're gonna need is something for your chest to go in between. So you're gonna have to have two different surfaces uh, for your hands to go on. This will give you a little bit of extra range of motion, but the goal is not to get a, like a whole ton. As you're gonna see, even with my pretty good range of motion, I don't try to get a whole ton of extra range of motion. But the way that it starts off, the first component is actually bending the knees before you initiate the descent, and then after you have ascended. So what it's gonna look like is this. You're gonna get into position, like so, bend the knees, lower, and then you're gonna lift, and then straighten the knees. Bend the knees, lower, lift, and straighten the knees. So what this does, you'll notice at the bottom, I kind of end up in this position. I'll show you once more. Bend the knees, lower, like this. Well, it's very similar to the bottom position of a dip. So the nice thing about this is that though it's still a push-up, it gets you familiar with that bottom position feeling for the dip. And what's better is this will probably give you a better indicator on just how prepared your shoulders are to do dips. For instance, if this doesn't feel very good, Odds are dips are gonna be a no-go, so you could just leave those out entirely. But I think that this will be a good alternative. You could do quite a few more reps with this one as well because the, a lot of weight is being taken out of the feet. So it's better for moderate rep sets of let's say eight to 12, so that when you start doing dips, you can start back over at a lower rep scheme and then work your way up if dips end up being a good option for you. So give these a try. Uh, remember it is bend the knees, lower yourself, and then lift yourself and then straighten the knees, all right? Uh, let me know if you have any other questions, need any other technique pointers. We'll go from there, enjoy.